Okay, children. So in our many compounds, we will discuss carboxy acids, children. So already we completed general reactions, we completed alcohols. Now we are doing carboxy acids, children. Okay. In general reactions, we studied combustion, oxidation, addition, substitution. In alcohols preparation, hydrolysis, we studied children. And in properties, we studied dehydration, esterification, saponification, oxidation, test number, and alcohols. Now today coming to carboxy acids. In carboxy acids, two things we study children. Preparation we study and also we study properties. Since uh, carboxic acids are acids, the, the form by its uh, function group is CO OH and suffix is folic acid. Suffix is folic acid. See, okay, and carboxic acids will form a group of organic acids. Carboxic acids will form what group of organic acids? Organic acids and membrane acids are different. Organic acids and membrane acids are different. Children. Organic acids means like this a methanoic acid, ethanoic acid, propanoic acid, butanoic acid, penta, hepta, 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 and magica. All these are organic acids. Membrane acids means which we see from HCl, hydrochloric acid, H2SO4, sulfuric acid, HNO3, nitric acid, okay? H2CO3, carbonic acid, HNO3, PO4, phosphoric acid. These all will form membrane acids. And organic acids means methanoic acid, methanoic acid, propanoic acid. But generally, organic acids are weak, children, and mineral acids are strong. Generally, generally these are strong, these are weak. Okay, why they are weak means uh, they are about partial decomposition. Partial decomposition. And why they are strong means they undergo complete decomposition, children. Complete decomposition. Partial decomposition means what? Complete means what? Suppose HCl is there, children. HCl. When you pass current, it breaks up into H plus and Cl minus ions completely. Whereas, suppose acetic acid is there. When you pass current children, it breaks up into CH3COO minus and H plus ions. Means some of the hydrogens are retaining the here only, all are not coming out. That is called partial decomposition. Because of partial decomposition, organic acids are weak, mineral acids are strong. Organic acids are weak, mineral acids are strong. But properties are same. Okay, what we are discussing from the beginning. Okay, in chemical reactions, metals and non-metals, so many places we discussed again and again, again and again. Same properties, the properties of acids won't change. What is that properties? Acid plus metal. Is what you know? Salt plus hydrogen plus. Salt plus hydrogen plus, same property. And acid plus base. Is what you know? Salt plus water. Salt plus water. Okay, children. Acid plus carbonate. Or bicarbonate, you wish you take anything, children. What do you get, children? Salt plus water plus carbon dioxide. Same properties, children. Even though they are weak acids, they are neutral oils. Even though they are weak acids, children, uh, properties doesn't change. Even though they are weak acids, properties does not change. Okay, children. For example, just we'll see you take compost, children, then we'll stop. Okay. Okay. Same properties. Have. Properties won't change. What is the okay? So let's see with the first acid. What is the first acid? Let's actually methanoic acid. First, I want to show with ethanoic acid. CH3COOH. CH3COOH. Okay. Many times we did this reactions in various various topics. Children, I hope you remember. CH3COOH. Okay. With metal. With base. With carbonate. With bicarbonate. Let's see, children. Because we discussed so many times, I'm not discussing new details. Okay, what you get? CH3COO in a salt plus metal means hydrogen as you get. Children. Metal means hydrogen. Yes. And acid plus base gives what children? Salt plus water. What is the salt? Same salt children. CH3COO in plus H2O. Water is in the acid plus base gives salt plus water neutralization. Acid plus base gives salt plus water neutralization. And here salt is same children, CH3CO4 and the salt is same. Water is common product. But carbonates and bicarbonates are like carbon dioxide, etc. Extra, extra carbon dioxide gas, compulsory carbonates are like carbon dioxide acids, so like carbon dioxide. Here also same salt, CH3CO4 and the plus H2O plus CO2 gas is liberated extra, CO2 gas is liberated extra. Okay, children? Those who did not understand, those who did not understand, one more word, children. Same CH3. Okay. Shall we change the acid children? Next propanoic acid is the children. 
H5COOH. Just add CH2 to this, you will get propanoic acid. Chain. Okay, propanoic acid C2 H5COOH. C2 H5COOH. C2 H5COOH. Okay, children. First with metal, then base, then respective <coughs> carbonate, then respective bicarbonate. Children. Okay, children. Acid plus metal, salt plus hydrogen gas. Don't ever forget in your life. Acid plus metal, acid plus metal, salt. Here, hydrogen gas will come out. We will see H3, COOK plus H2 gas. Okay, this is called potassium. Oh, sorry, C2H2. C2H5C. C2H5C. This is called potassium. Potassium. Children, this is sodium. This is potassium. Proto. 2 plus 1, 3, no? Potassium propanoid. Okay. Here also same children. K will come here. H will come here. C2, H5, COO, K plus H2O. Okay, children. And here also same children. Here this, this will come here. C2, H5, COO, K plus water plus carbon dioxide and gas is constant. Here also same. This here, this here children. What do you get? C2, H5, COO, K plus H2O plus CO2 gas. Okay, children. Suppose if anyone have doubt, then we'll discuss one more chain, last one more. I will say chain. properties of the entering children. Same properties acid plus metal gives salt plus hydrogen gas, acid plus base gives salt plus water, acid plus carbon gives salt plus water plus carbon dioxide, acid plus bicarbonate gives salt plus water plus carbon dioxide. Okay, children. One more children. Can anyone say propanoic acid formula? C3H7COH. C3H7COH. But sodium is over potassium. Next with calcium. Calcium. C3H7COOH. Calcium hydroxide respective base. C3H7COOH. Respective carbonate formula. CA. CO2. CA CO3. Respective bicarbonate formula. Anyone? Bicarbonate calcium bicarbonate. Anyone? CA CO3. Second. Taken twice. So, children, here calcium will go in, hydrogen compound. C3H7. C3 hydrogen gas, children, two times. Okay, children, this is two times because calcium charge is plus two, children. This is plus two, this is minus one. Two comes here, one goes there, twice. Cause calcium, calcium, but now eight. Calcium, three plus one, four, but now eight. Here also same children, hydrogen comes out, calcium in C3, H7, COO, taken twice, calcium plus H2O, calcium group 3 plus 1, 4, COO8, calcium between 8, okay children, or calcium, okay children, next thing, C3, H7, COO, taken twice, CA plus H2O plus CO2 gas, okay children, next one, here also same children. C3, H7, COO, taken twice, CA, plus H2O, plus CO2. CO2 turns lime water milky. What is the test for CO2? CO2 turns lime water milky. So children, calcium, we don't know. Calcium, we don't know. First time we got, first time calcium, as, uh, sodium acetate. Then next one, potassium, propanoid. Third one, calcium, we don't know. Like this, you can practice, children. Next, you can practice with the octobutanoic acid, pentanoic acid, C4, H9, CO, O, H, you practice with magnesium salts, children. Magnesium, magnesium hydroxide, magnesium carbonate, magnesium bicarbonate. If you are still interested, next to C5, H11, CO, O, H, after magnesium, what you tell children? Aluminium. Aluminium. Aluminium, aluminium hydroxide, aluminium carbonate, and aluminium bicarbonate. Like that, you have to practice, children. How much you practice, that much strong you will become in chemistry. Magnesium, magnesium hydroxide you should practice, magnesium carbonate you should practice, magnesium bicarbonate you should practice. Same thing, children. Again, next one with the aluminum zinc, next one with the iron, next one with the lead. Like that, you should practice. Then you become very, very strong how to balance the reactions, how to write the formulas. You become you become perfect in writing the reactions, children. Okay, just if you listen and leave it in, you can't get children. You have to put pen on the paper and start doing them. You understand what are the difficulties you will face while writing the reaction. This is how you have to practice children. These are the properties. So, children in carboxylic acids, 
the way of decarboxylic acids, generally it's a decarboxylic acids. So preparation is there, process is done. What are the properties? Acid plus metal gives salt plus hydrogen gas. Acid plus base gives salt plus water. Acid plus carbonate gives salt plus water plus carbon dioxide. Acid plus bicarbonate gives salt plus water plus carbon dioxide gas. These are the things you do. Now preparation. How do you prepare carboxylic acids? Anyone? How do you prepare carboxylic acids? Anyone? Present oxidation. Oxidation. So alcohol on oxidation. We study the children. Carboxylic acids. Alcohol on oxidation gives carboxylic acids in presence of alkaline KMnO4 or acidified K2Cr2O7 K2 Cr2O7 potassium dichromate. Okay, alcohols on oxidation gives carboxylic acids. We discussed already in general reactions. We discussed in properties of alcohols. We discussed again in preparation of carboxylic acids also same. Alcohols on oxidation gives carboxylic acids. What alcohols? Methanol gives methanolic acid. Methanol, ethanol acid. Propanol on oxidation, propanolic acid. Pentanol, pentanolic acid. Pentanol, pentanolic acid. Like that. Up to decanol to decanolic acid and so on. So oxidation we study. Properties we study. So on the whole, carboxylic acids are over. So till now, children. So what are the reactions we discussed in organic chemistry? First one was combustion, then oxidation, then addition, then substitution. These are general reactions. Okay, children. Then in alcohols we studied hydrolysis for preparation, dehydration, esterification, saponification, oxidation, test for properties in alcohols. These are properties. This is preparation. And in carboxylic acids, our preparation is oxidation. Erosate came, erosate came, erosate came, oxidation. And uh, properties, first one is with metals, next one with base, carbonates, bicarbonates. Bicarbonate. Bicarbonates. Metals, base, carbonate, bicarbonate. That's it, children. So how many reactions? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Two times oxidation, you remove children. So 13 reactions. Because three times oxidation comes in, two times you remove. So 13 reactions are there. These 13 reactions with all metals, with all up to get to take if you practice, you will become perfect in carbon compounds. Children. Next year, tomorrow onwards, we'll discuss about the soap cleaning action and I will discuss all those things. Children. But what I will suggest you is practice from method to take all the actions you practice. They won't ask you in textbook, they won't ask you in exam. But practice is important. We are not writing, we are not uh, practicing for examination purpose, children, for our interest, our knowledge also. Please practice. Okay, children. Thank you so much.